Hi, everybody. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, let me put these sounds off because they're kind of loud, but that's why I usually don't have sounds on in Second Life. Well, it's not the environment. It's usually the people and their stuff on them that <laughs> is giving me headaches around. Uh, but yeah, today we're going to check the Sakura region. So we're going to talk a little about... Okay, yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna talk a little about Linden Lab homes, right? So if you are a premium in Second Life, so if you pay for the premium, you can get a Linden Lab home as far as everybody knows, right? Or maybe if you're new to Second Life and you don't, we're gonna just open this map because I usually go around for the, with the maps and how it is. So um, as you know, Linden Lab started building a whole new continent called Belisera. So it's now spending a lot. So this is the old continent right up here. So this one, and then they're starting building Belisera down here with all the new, um, you know, there's Victorian homes, log homes, uh, stilt homes. Uh, this is all the homes I already showed. Uh, we did either we did how the homes will look or we did home invasions after them. So just went to the random houses and checked how they are. I think all of this is stilt homes here and also here you have the boat homes right so uh houses on on the water right and also here there's log homes i think yeah this whole region is log homes i think log homes are still the most popular homes in second life for now the region is huge as you see it maybe victorian and those are kind of close but you see the region of sakura now it's smaller right and down here uh it's also the fantasy homes i mean this is getting bigger and bigger so i so wish i could find a houseboat home um yeah so how this goes uh i don't maybe we can go let me check if i can go on my account and just show you a little how to get the linden lab home Ugh, i would have to log in uh but yeah it depends on what is available i know what you're talking about sometimes the homes are full and you cannot get them right away I'm going to try to just jump on here. Yeah, this would be okay, I think. There. Uh, okay, so yeah, here when you are on your page, um, you can always just explore your Linden home. So if you are a premium and you have premium membership, you can visit your Linden Lab home and you can also kind of get it. So if I say go now, I don't have a Linden Lab home, so they will ask me of what Linden Lab home I want, right? So Belisera... I think those Meadowbrook, Tahoe, Elgar, those are the old uh, Linden Lab homes. You will see how old they look. See, those are not popular probably anymore. I mean, you can apparently still grab it if you want. I have no idea why would you. Some still like to, like to live there, but I think the point of Linden Lab is now ev to move everybody to Belisera. And now there are so many homes available. You have the traditional homes, you have houseboats. They come in different styles, right? Of course, I did videos about that. But for now, as you see, view all houses. Ooh, stilt homes are apparently not, of, are they? View more pictures. They did already so many homes, to be honest. Um, okay. Can you like grab it next? Uh-huh, stilt home. Name your home. Could I grab the stilt home if it's there? Because I just view fewer. Huh. Interesting. Is this all available? That's my question. Because I could, could name and grab it probably. Or is it not available? That's... Hmm. Load the effing houseboats. <laughs> but yeah, there's so many now. And of course, the new one is the Sakura region. And that's why we, what we're going to talk about today. So here is the Sakura. You can grab the five, 520 or 1024 square meters, apparently. It's both options that you can get. So the smaller and the bigger plots. Uh, today we're going to do some home invasions on that part. Because <laughs> why not? But yeah, kind of you get it. If you are a premium, you, you can get the Linden home. Uh, I did want to talk about the Sakura region now. Because the Sakura region is located here. Uh, you can see some people are already living here. Now, the main part, I think, which is interesting is this Soji Mountain, which is plastered in the middle of the whole region. We can teleport at the end there, if I remember, probably I will forget. 
I did explore a little the whole thing. It's a lot of water, so I think it's it's pretty much easier to get a house beside the water than maybe some other regions like here, right? Because there are so many houses inland, right? But here you have so many water canals everywhere that probably if you try a few times, you could get... Uh, I know everybody wants to live by the water, right? The other interesting thing I saw is this big building here and they built a community center and that's what we're going to check first. Uh, I said we're going to explore the region first and then we're going <laughs> to just go um, to some people's homes uninvited. Yeah, maybe some people would be pissed, but... I did check that I found homes that the doors are open and we are not thrown out. So as long as your door is open and you don't have a security or I think we're good, right? I did ask one guy if I can show his house, but he was like, oh, ask my wife. Uh, she's not online now. And I was like, it's fine. We're going to skip your home. We're going <laughs> to go to the homes that we are. I think we are invited. I didn't ask them, but hey, their door is open. There's no... You know, there's no weird stuff. How do you get to look at the maps like you're doing now? Okay, so you... Can I do... Wait, let me just hide this. Um, so I'm going to go in the full mode. So if you go to world, uh, you have the world map, right? So if you open the world map, you'll see the whole world of, uh, of Second Life. At one point, I will do a video about how the whole world looks. But yeah, not, right now we are on this region. You can also drag the toolbars there. So right click and you get the toolbar buttons and you just drag the, I have it uh, here on the side. You see what I'm clicking here? So world map on the left side of the my screen. I did drag one of the toolbars there. Let me find it though. Uh, inventory map. So this, this toolbar here, uh, you know what? Maybe we need a cursor for this. So you can see my mouse. Yeah, so here, the map I dragged here on the site and I can access it really quickly. So yeah, there, you can see the world map like this. It's really easy to travel uh, and we're going to start with the community center here, which is probably everybody can visit. You can clearly see it on the Mac, map here. So Sakura community region, it's on uh, Shobu, Shobu Sim. There we go. Actually, it's in Soji-san Southwest, I guess, a little, is it? No, it's on Shobu region. Sorry, Shobu, yeah. So Shobu uh, Sim, let's call it a Sim there. Um, okay, we can start, stop tracking this if we can stop. How the hell again do we stop tracking? Oh no, I forgot. Maybe like this, right? Okay, you know what? Stop it. There. Okay. Anyway, so let's go and explore this community center. Turn me. Uh, I think this is more for hanging out. Um, right now, you can get these homes. You're gonna check some of them if you maybe like the Japanese theme and stuff. I'll put some sounds on just so we will make it more. Um, you know, there's a better feeling here, right? Aha, uh -huh, and we are going back to this because yeah, looks better. With Control M, you open the map as well. Let me try that. Control M. Hmm, for me, it doesn't work. Ah, it does. Okay, Control M is also a map. Okay. Perfection. Thanks. I usually have it just on fast on the side, right? Because usually I do need a map. Uh, so yeah, community center. This is looking really Japanese. So let's go inside and check how it is. I'm going to take the cursor away because it's a little bothering to see the mouse all the time. Lol, my pet. Click on the red arrow or clear on the map. There we go. Okay, let's enter. This should be Japanese. And oh, look at this. So yeah, we're going to check... Mm, there, there are sounds here. We're gonna check how they decorate it in Japanese style. Inside, this is probably 100% done by malls, right? Um, it is a center where everybody can visit. Uh, if you wanna know something, you know, just stop me. Because, I don't know, probably this is not something that is sold, right? Yeah, Maple Red Tree, that is something from Linden Lab. So here we won't find nothing probably from creators directly. Um, oh, look at this hall. 
We're gonna go to homes later, of course. Uh, there's a beautiful garden around here, so we're gonna check that. But I still wanna check what they build as a community center. I've seen a lot of hangout places up here, so you have tables and everything, you know, in Japanese style. Some sushis. Are sushis done by them too, or did they actually? Gian, ah! Huh? Okay, Gian Sushi Sushimi. So they did use some of the creators, I get guess, for some decor. I'm gonna bet the chairs are done by them, yeah, okay. It is bar by moles, right? Welcome. A lot of comments work with uh, control and when the according letter inventory, for an example. Hayabusa has nice Japanese style trees and plants. Yeah, we're gonna see some of them probably in the houses of people, because I did see that people did a lot outside too, right? But yeah, first this community, so yeah, it's really, it's a place to hang, I guess, maybe. There's not a lot of people around though, to be honest, so... Yeah, definitely nobody in the community center. The problem with Second Life is I, I hear it non-stop, like it's empty, it's empty, it's empty. The problem is the there are so and so many people playing at any given point. Let's say there are 35,000 people logged in, but the world of Second Life is so freaking huge, right? And that's the main problem. Like there are so many places you can go to. It's ridiculous, right? So, you know, it's hard to kind of get them in one place except if it's a party if it's an event if it's whatever else so there i i was talking about the cute garden here in the middle so look at this they did a pretty like zen garden here um in the community center you would think lin lab would put some of those items in the library folder in inventory <laughs> the stuff currently is it is old yeah that's why i was thinking why don't they like they should hire somebody like one of those cool creators that do such cute furniture and you know because this yeah it's it does look a little old i'm not i mean sorry milly mole whoever is doing this stuff right but i wish they would uh hire like good creators in second life that do like really nice stuff okay glowing mole apparently does some cute this is not bad the rocks are not looking bad right but you know Where's your hair from, Naria? Uh, I think it's still... Oh, is it Stealtic? Wait, let me just... So it is Stealtic Searching called. I'm searching for cute houses today. There. But no, it's really called Stealtic Searching. Uh, so yeah, community center di down, done nicely. We're gonna check the gardens too, because this is not the only gardens this community center has. But I think it's like really nicely done, so... I wish it was looking a little less old, but you know how Linden homes are. It's just probably, sometimes it's just how you decorate them. You can do so much on your own. And I'm going to show you in some houses that I found around. Uh, so yeah, that's, it, it's a hangout place where it's empty, I guess. They have strawberry sink, but I'm not sure exactly what she does as uh, strawberry sing is just for uh, uh, social media, so it means she does their YouTube or posts, right? So nothing, nothing. A mall actually malls are been building, as you know, Lindens are usually working at Linden Lab, so it could be social media, it could be uh, marketing, it could be whatever else, and the headquarters they're doing like programmers and so on, right? But the problem is that uh, malls are the ones building the world, right? So they're kind of separate. So whatever it's built here in world, they're malls, right? Linden should hire you, Naria. Um, I, I don't know when I went into that story, but uh, maybe one day when I feel really angry about Linden Lab, uh, I did have an, an encounter with them a couple of times. Uh, they don't want to promote anything of my videos. Uh, Maybe if if you really want that story, I can go into it. But I wanted to hold up a little because I'm still in the talks. I wanted to come to the... What is the department? Abuse department reports or something. Because apparently my videos were reported and they kind of approved that they were wrong or something. And now they don't want to promote none of my stuff. So, you know, I doubt that I'll be hired ever. But it's fine. We do this for fun, so... Uh, who are the pink trees there? 
there's a lot of pink trees. I'm gonna presume the pink trees are probably from Linden Lab, but malls. So ancient mall did this tree. This tree was were done with ancient mall. So these are all trees done uh, from malls. So I don't know how how you can come to these trees. But as I said, if we're not at the homes of the people. That's a big rip, I know. If we're not at the homes of the people, uh, I think we're not going to see a lot of the creator stuff, right? Mostly the stuff it does. What could Lyndon complain about in your videos? They're helpful. <laughs> Maybe I should show you my, my uh, emails with uh, our dear strawberry Lyndon, uh, but I won't. It's fine. Maybe one day when I'm like more disappointed with Lyndon Lab, which might be sooner then later but yeah i don't want to go now in the whole story of this but yeah i do have some um, some stuff <laughs> that i could show but yeah for now it's fine i'm gonna just do this <laughs> and that's it okay anyway so let's go on i think uh there's a garden here as i said so they do have a garden really question mark. really uh, i do have a i do they have a garden here look how cute it looks though so we can go down by the river. I think this is done like if you're living here, you can just, I don't know, relax in their garden. Just go around a little, have some fun. Uh, should we enter that garden there? Because there's so much to go to. Look at this. Yeah. That garden is actually huge. Let me see where we are on the map. though. Okay, so that garden spans. You see where I'm standing? Uh down here with the yellow dot and with my camera already down there so all of this is already a garden it's huge by the way look at this and this is going all around because i think this is somebody's house already let me see yeah this then starts the region houses and everything so yeah the garden looking oh they do have bunnies from uh, HPM. Oh my God, guys, these bunnies are so cute, but so high on land impact. HPMD, the cutest bunnies ever. I have them too in my inventory, but the land impact, it's 19 for a bunny, right? <laughs> they, they are animals, but they're so cute. Look at them hopping around. Whoa, it's a big, very pretty. Whoa, you are, you are alive. I'm in Northeastern Pennsylvania, USA. Never caught you live. I love your videos and follow you all the time. Thank you for your awesome. Thank you, Holly. Someday you should go to Fantasy Home Community. I was at Fantasy Homes. It was so hard to find decorated homes. I was one time there uh, gro going around and I didn't find <laughs> that they decorated it at all. So I said I will wait a little, right? But here it was kind of easy. I think a lot of people moved to the Sakura region, actually. Which is quite understandable. I, I, I bet the Japanese culture is really popular, right? Oh my god, so many bunnies. The land impact on all of those, wait. It's up, it's up together. 57 land impacts with three bunnies. <laughs> I'm in New York, Holly. Sometimes she's live in the middle of the night for us. Yeah, that that I bet that might be a problem. But uh, usually I'm live just for Saturday sales, right? So... Or in my evenings, which can be, yeah. Um, there. So this is the whole garden. Now let's go to people's homes, which I know it's the point of home invasions, right? As I said, I will go like this. If the door is open, I I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to presume I'm invited in. And if I don't get thrown out. I did find some homes that I liked. So we're going to go check them out. I did find first home. Oh, no, wait. Before we go to the homes, there is also a train station here, which I bet it's everywhere because all this uh, Linden or the whole Belisera has train tracks around. So this is how the train station looks on the Sakura land. Look at this. You know what? Maybe we should put this a little more down. There we go. So yeah, these are the trains that go around probably Belisera. I don't know when they depart, if they even depart. I didn't see none of them riding or yet so if somebody lives on belisera are they even moving <laughs> now to the interesting part of the stream i don't know linden has not to worry about the land impact true is it true though let me see how much prims do they have yeah thirty thousand prims per region right so it's only two thousand available they did use it all 
to be honest, almost. Kind of a lot. So no wonder every house can have only 351 <laughs> trims because they used everything. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, these are the train stations. Do the trains work? Yeah, that's my question too. I did sit on it before, but it didn't move. So yes, I live on Long Island. Are the Linden regions gonna season change like fall, winter, summer, etc., or is the same as all year round? I think it might be the same. Uh, I'm not sure about some of them, but I'm sh pretty much sure the Sakura won't change, I think. Uh, and definitely these ones won't change. Like you're living on a water, right? It's constant summer there. I'm, I'm sure of it, right? Um, I don't know. I think it would be too much work to change all the regions, like everything to snow. I think like given how much land they have now, right? With all of this. I know uh, where's, isn't the, the fantasy thing where they change stuff, I think, or not. I know something is where they change seasons or just they change something somewhere. I forgot on which region, but I'm sure here they they will not. Also Sakura, because it's Sakura, right? It's like right of the time of March or April. I don't think they will change to winter because the point is you have Sakura trees, right? And you have them in March or April, usually in Japan. So I think this will stay as that because they then they this wouldn't be sakura anymore with these trees right fantasy home change change every season Aha, okay thanks petite i knew that it was some of them i don't know about the others right i think it's a lot of work to change seasons especially if they have so much land now the problem is if that would be like a few seams or let's say like a region like this ju just like this but look how huge this is how many seams they would have to just exchange the seasons on right so Maybe if they would have automatically changed the trees and the ground, but I think it's more than that, right? If, you, if you're if you trying to do snow or leaves fall, that means like every little bush has to be changed. You know, it's, it's probably a lot of work, but we don't have snow, snow, grass too and flowers. It's probably a lot. I, I don't think Sakura will change though, because I think the point is that the Sakura trees are blooming, right? So that's kind of that. What is that? <gasps> Sakura Community Gardens. Oh, there's actually like a entrance to this. Okay. There we go. Where are we on the map? Just in case if somebody wants to come here. Aha, uh -huh, so you can enter from this side. So if this is the train station down where we were standing, you just go... Uh, wait, what about minimap? Can we check the minimap? Wait, minimap is somewhere here, right? There we go. Yeah, but we don't see good on mini-maps because, damn, that sucks. Okay, uh, but yeah, you can see the train station just running down on my, um, actually on my left side, right? But yeah, you can enter the gardens and we are again at the community center, so we did check that. Okay, let's go to the homes. The first home I will show you will be something just the outside and I will show you... The doors are not open, so I'm not going to go inside. I'm not going to even try. So I did write house one outside. I think we can check outside, right? Uh, but we're going to check it outside because I think they did nice work outside already. Look, so as I said, everybody can do their own stuff outside for themselves to make it look more Japanese, I guess, right? You can put your own trees, your own waterfalls, your own stuff outside. So, you know, you can make it look a lot more uh you know japanese or in sakura times by yourself right so you can buy from creators actually so this tree should be somebody so this is heart willow wood ancient cherry tree so if somebody is looking for cherry trees i guess there you go sakura trees whatever there i think this is also on the floor from yeah same stuff so it's hard still um but yeah, I thought they decorated it so nicely outside. Look at with all, with the statue and the uh, Hisa climbing wines that are pink in the back. Those are cute also. Maybe if you're living in this region and you want some ideas how to, you know, make it look cute, why not? So we have Hisa, if you know, uh, HPMD, Sweet Garden Grass. There, and this statue should be from... 
Maru Kado, Stone Statue. Also, every time you can check uh, the creators down here, right? So if you don't find, just go on the creator and check where their store is and so on, right? You can always check by creators. Cute. I, I think it's like nicely done outside, especially those waterfalls here. Look how cute they are. Just going inside. The door is not open, so we're going to skip the outside. Grass, too, and flowers, but we don't have snow. Uh -huh. That was petite at the end. This is moss and mink. Uh, Valerie water fountain. Huh. Interesting. Maybe I should write this down to you like this. If, you, if somebody wants to buy it, you know what I mean? It's going to be much easier. There's also a doggy running around. Look at that. Who you? Uh, Corgi, I think it is, right? Akita. Oh, no. I thought it's a... Cor oh, yeah. By the tail. Now I see. Uh, so, Wonder Pop from Gian. Are those already animes or... Ooh, 47 land impact. Ooh, they afforded, though. I imagine you have only 351 primps available and then you use 47 for the dog outside. Ouch. I get it, though. It's a cute dog. <laughs> but... I would never with so so little prims, right? Yeah, that that's a bitch when you have a terrace, but it is a cute doggy outside. Not gonna lie. How they fit everything in three hundred fifty? It's not that. I don't know how it's. I mean, I I didn't check inside, but they have it pretty empty. You see, it's more like this. But we're not gonna go too much inside. No open door. Um, but yeah, outside also this. This is from Kopfkino. Tranquility Water Garden. This looks like it could be used. Tub. Pretty. What's inside? <gasps> There's a fishy inside. Oh, that's cute. How much prims is this? Ten. Oh, that's not that bad. Looks really cute though. Also, these vines could be dropped down, I guess. That doesn't look bad either. So, Love Wisteria Falls. Cristalli Rabeni. Nice. Caught home invasions. Love proof is going to be a good day. Hi, Nari. Hey, Susie. So, yeah, this is how I wanted to show it outside. But we do have some cute gardens also around. So, this is the shape of this house, right? Because, uh, you know, once you get the one house, you can choose different style of houses. So, a person can choose different style of houses on their land. So, this one choose like kind of an... What kind of letter could that be? Like L and something out of it, right? Also in the back they have like fishes and so on. There we go. But yeah, I think they made like a cute outside um, for that. Okay, I did just show... Oh, look, and also bamboo. I think bamboos go great with like Japanese style, right? Bamboo trees. So sky bamboo palm there. Bamboo palm. Uh... Oh, yeah, they favor to rise the exterior. I do get it, though. If you would see my home, which I have to do, apparently, a uh, home tour at one point, because I, I seen I did it two years ago. I didn't change much, though, so to be honest, not much to do. But uh, if I do home tour, uh, you'll see, like, I stand outside my home all the freaking time, right? It's I don't know why, but I just... I just like to stand outside, to be honest. <laughs> it's it's my thing. So I do get it that some people like to just do exteriors more. Okay, uh, let's go to house number two. Let's see what they have. This one, this door was open, so I think we can go inside. I did choose like homes that are more Japanese feel. Also, this one got hit by the water and on the end, actually. So as I was talking about those canals around, landscaping is gorgeous there. Um, so yeah, as I was talking about where you can land your home, because this is totally, you cannot choose this, except I think when you are premium plus now, it's something with choosing where to have a home. But look, this one actually have it on the end and has such a nice view of the whole land around. Especially if you go to some cool, like there are some cool... Um, Wait, what the, the hell did I use? If you change the how the whole uh, um, sky looks, right? So you see, you can make. Where did I have that pink one that I like so much? Look at this. You can have such a cute view. There we go. You see what I mean? You can do a lot with the 
wind lights around. Especially if you go on ultra, but I don't want to bother my computer too much because that would be a problem. A big one. I did have some other, but let me see. So yeah, if you have a nice view, I think if you wait, I mean, if you grab this Linden Homes a couple of times and you get the place where you really want to get it. Oh God, that's, that, that's not it. <laughs> Look at this, we can have hearts in the sky because why not? <laughs> I think Premium Plus has had or is saying about the option that you could choose that you could live with your, or your... Is Premium Plus really worth it? How much does it cost as opposed to Premium? I would say no. If you're not a creator, I would definitely say no. So if you go to talk about... I will r uh, run around the house and talk about Premium Plus, right? So I think Premium Plus is more a package for creators because you're going to get the upload of textures, animations, and sounds for free. So it's not 10 lindens anymore, but it's free. So, I mean, is, was it this kakatu here? Damn it. Um, so if you get, um, I think that's the only plus and you're, you're going to pay 250 something lindens, uh, lind, $250 a year, which is a lot, right? If you're giving the premium, uh, it's a lot less, right? Premium is $99 a year, so that's not that much. Um, you get everything double, double the stipend. But if you want everything double, I would suggest you to, to just grab like two premiums, right? If you want the same money and the same land, right? You can always do that. Okay, there we go. And you can get then on your, all well... It's kind of hard, but you can get the land then on mainland and one Linden home, right? And then just put it on a group and use it yourself. So some people just take two premiums, right? On their alts and them, and then kind of combine the perks. And that would cost you $200 per year, not 250 So I think like premium plus is more for, you know, I would say for uh, creators, right? It is a creator pack. So if you're not a creator, I wouldn't suggest premium plus. Anyway, so this house, I thought it looks so Japanese. It's like, look at the walls, look at all the things around. Also the kitchen. I like the kitchen. I don't know about that wallpaper, but hey, each of its own. But look at that kitchen corner. Look how cute is this? <laughs> and they're making sushi, by the way. Holy wallpaper, Batman. I know. <laughs> It's like interesting how much wallpaper they put, but kind of makes it look cool, to be honest. Look at this sushi making, by the way, I guess, and some other stuff. I don't know what all the weird sounds are around. Sounds like there's a bird. Sounds sounds like there's something clapping around. I'm going to just put it on. See? But yeah, right. There was something. That I don't know what that was. Uh, and here... Look how they did the freaking uh, bathroom. Come on. This is this looks so Japanese. Can I open? <gasps> oh my god, this is so cool. Come on. <laughs> this is like the best shit ever. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm bathing in somebody's bed, but I don't know. This looks so Japanese, right? This is like the best thing. I saw this house and I was like, yep. There we go. That's that's like cute, cute, right? I don't know about the wallpapers. Yeah, it's a lot, but hey, at the other hand, it's also a little... This middle part is a little maybe too much of wallpaper, of course. But hey, each its own taste, you know. They want to make it Japanese. They went a little overboard, but it's fine. It's fine. I do like the bathroom, right? And outside is also pretty. Look at all these flowers. And here's a Zen garden and, you know, everything around. It's kind of cute. Hope nobody feels I'm invading their homes, but hey. The, oh, the door was open. I'm going to take it as an invitation. Also, I really like this. This is so cute. Where's this from? Uh, soy lace woven hammock for eight land impact. Kind of cute. From where is the bat? Aha, uh -huh, bat. Okay. Wait, let me just lay on their hammock because it's so cute. Look at this. Why am I still there? Okay, I'm going to lay on the hammock till somebody kills me. But let's check the bath. Really, where did I get the bat? So this is Angelo. Okay bathroom is a whole bathroom from angelo actually okay that's what it says angelo is like 
maybe you'll find that store or just check the creator that I wrote here. Select edit link. Let me see if we can. Yeah, it's still on. It's still the same creator, so it should be from Angela. There. Really Japanese, but I do like this hammock outside. It's so cute. Look at that. Ta-da! Really nice. Okay, let's leave the bird alone. Let's go to our house number four. The third one I deleted because the guy was like, "Oh, ask my wife about it," and I was like, "Ah, uh, no." Ain't nobody got time for that guy. Let's go to house number four. I think this one is also open, but it's also a party house. So how cool is that in a Sakura, there is a party house. Actually, they have a DJ place and everything. I think somebody might be a DJ who has, has this house and just said, fuck it. <laughs> let's have a party house. Let's have a bar. Let's have a dance floor. Let's have a DJ set, right? So let's go here. Let's check what they have. Also, door opened. <laughs> every time I'm gonna say door opened it's allowed but look how cute this looks though is this actually the this is like a small house house Ban Banbara okay 512 okay I don't know if they placed I think they placed this here this is so cute though how did they do that Cheek Aeon okay that's, that's somebody made this okay interesting i think this is like a cute expansion to all of this right you have that also they made really nice outside look okay let's go inside to the party house we go not sure why everyone would not want you showing off their home i would be thrilled if naria popped into my i know but i did had some <laughs> i did had some nasty messages some time ago when home invasions were really home invasions right when i did went into people's homes uninvited uh yeah some people are not happy i don't get why right it's like it's nothing that serious inside i i usually don't show the kinky stuff if people have inside you know so where's the point okay so here's like uh just a room to eat i guess sit and eat what i did like here is the bar and we're gonna go to the bar it's a kind of simple inside like i, I kind of like it like you know japanese home should be a little more simple it's like a cute sofa from Finca, Montana sofa. There, if somebody wants the sofa. I don't know. I don't get it either. It's nothing bad to be sure. Ooh, cheese. <laughs> this is, oh, what next? I think Harvest Cheese Board. And what next? Uh, wine Caddy. Ooh. I think this, sh this was on... Uh, 15 and Friday at some point, the Caddy. Okay, but look at the bar. It's so cute. We have to check where the bar is from. This looks so good, though. So the bar is from... Oh, God, no. Far Sakura Bar. Oh, no, we will never... Bela Tolson is the owner. Hmm. Is this even buyable? This looks cute, though. And the beer is waiting for us. Where, what more do we want? Also, look at all these drinks. Classic beans. Oh, no. <laughs> Is this a freaking cup? Oh, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> Beans and drinks. Hmm. Kind of questionable, but okay. Cute, though. I like the bar. It goes with the whole thing. And now the outside, they just have a dance floor. Look at this. I would have a party here, to be honest. And there's a DJ booth. DJ Far. Aha, uh -huh. Bella Far, DJ Far. Hmm. The, way to get. the longest running weekly party in Belisera. That's something new. Anybody living in Belisera and know something about it? Whose home I stumbled upon? I do like how they did the place, right? So they t took this small house, actually, and then they just did all this water around. They built a dance floor, put it on those boards. They even have a game of on the, that bull they have some man ah, that looks cute you wouldn't even say this is like a place is there a, actually yeah there is no yeah there is actually land there the land and then they put their own water in and everything like props to them that they actually built water around look at this because this was all on land right you must understand these parcels you look like that when you get them so like this and they turned it into like 
almost submerged house here. I mean, house on water almost, right? <laughs> they did it nicely though. It look, looks really cute to be honest. So yeah, that's one part that you can do, I guess. Look at this also, there's something. What is here? Oh, interesting. Just another board. Looks cute though. Okay, nicely done though. I would say props to building all of this outside, to be honest. It's it's really looking nice. Okay, let's go to our next home. These are the small homes, 512. Very nice. I know, right? Looks looks pretty good. Okay, let's go to our next home, which is, let's see, open door probably. <laughs> One, I know it doesn't have open door, but oh, look, how did he find me? Let's go. So I think this is the outside that it's really nice of this home. Yeah, open door. We said open door. It's okay. If it doesn't throw you out, out and if the door is open. I would say again, props on the whole um, garden. I can't believe people do such cute gardens, especially with so little prims, right? Imagine you have 351 prims and then you put all this patches together right these are okay these are one land impact which is not bad but how about all these bamboo trees one oh good on making ev this is seven all together uh -huh, so they linked it kind of got you and this patch is only one okay now i get it how kind of okay if the patch is one then yeah it's understandable but they built such nice gardens to be honest before you enter the house right because this is all built Oh, they have a doggy called Jojo Bear. Jojo Bear. Oh my god, he's so cute. This one is from... Uh, what is that store again? God damn it. The the room. The 50... Okay, so they even have <laughs> so many prims that they put a 54 prim dog on the land. Again, somebody. <laughs> there is great low prim stuff in the world. Helen are, yeah, I'm saying, but you know, you have to decorate the house, you have to decorate outside, and then you even have prims left to put a freaking 54 land impact dog outside, right? I wouldn't mind Naria visiting me either, and if I got her autograph to hang on my wall. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. Unfortunately, not everybody's so nice in Cycle Life, right? But yeah, these people who leave the doors open, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it as an invitation. So let's go inside. How big is this land though, to be honest? They have a little bigger house, but I think this one might still be... Okay, wait, let me see. This one is 1,024 square meters, so this is not the smallest house you can have, right? It's like the 1,024. Okay, let's see inside. Oh. This is like more modern a little, but still, I think still has Japanese feel because of, look at the... Uh, swords and all the pictures on the walls also here when you go into the room look at the look at this wallpaper though guys bamboo wallpaper doesn't it look cute <laughs> everybody hit the like button the best SL content on YouTube oh thank you PLC but yeah I, I kind of love the wallpaper it makes it look so good <laughs> oh my god there's a doggy watching outside no you okay look at him Oh my god, it's the cutest shit ever. Hello. There we go. Let your heart, heart smell by the doggy. <laughs> I will check where it's from though. Let's see. This one is just static. So Foxwood. Fawn Frenchie. Stand. Okay. As we know, Foxwood has uh, just um, not moving animals. But yeah. Oh my god, look at this scene though. Two cats wanting the two freaking cute birds. Okay, that's kind of cute. <laughs> there, there's a whole scene of cats catching the birds in here. So yeah, I really like this home. I, I, I love the wallpaper though. It look it makes this room look so cute though. There we go. So this is like a bedroom. Also, there's not much, right? You have just this thing on the... Where's this from? Uh, Havana bedroom. Wait, select face. Cosmetics from nobody. What about edit linked? Vanessa difference. Who you? Difference furnitures and accessories marketplace. Okay, just find her maybe for this, I guess. But it's cute. 
looking nice. Okay, so this is the bedroom. Let's see the... Oh, look at the dining table, though. Looking fancy. Oh, that's cute. Where are you from? Craftwork Aragon dining set. Craftwork... Uh -huh. So, Craftwork Ar Aragon dining set. Oh, that's... I love the kitchen chairs. The, uh, the kitchen there. We're gonna see. Oh, look at this. Also, lo must love the decor. Look, this makes it look Japanese right away, right? With all the... This looks cute. This whole thing is bamboo mat, 100% mesh, full perm. God knows where they got that. Maybe check the creator, right? I do love all of the settings. Now, let's go to the kitchen, which I think... Living room we set is just easy here and the uh, fireplace and that but kitchen looks nice look at this love the lights above the table i think they might are they ag again from no they are from who what japanese something let pendant light also creator luna piena there somebody's looking for her now let's check the kitchen where is this from Chemoa Belshire Kitchen, same Belshire Kitchen, and this fridge is from Kaza. Okay, by the sea drink shelves. Oh, so they kind of mixed it together. Okay. Oh, look at this drink fridge, though, or whatever. This looks cute. Oh, all the Heinekens inside. <laughs> it's zero zero two. That's so cute. <laughs> you have the Heineken and zero zero alcohol free Heineken. Okay. And the wine rack. Okay, that's kind of cute. Oh, there's also on the side. Look. Those flowers are going inside, but okay. Also, this is cute. I really like this house. This one is really... A uh, fourth wall there. Whoever did this, good, good on you. Good job. How do people find all this nice stuff to decorate? I need to hire these people to decorate my homes. I think it's with years and years of buying stuff I'm going to presume, right? Oh God, Thorn, you scared me for fuck's sake. There, and this is the garden. I also think it looks cute. I, I hear some ducks. Wait. No, frogs. Might be frogs. Thorn, you scared me. <laughs> yes. I really like outside too. They did really nice. Also, look at all this hanging stuff from the top looks so cute okay let me turn the water off or i'll have to go pee also this i have this in my house this is from tart looks really nice so tart palette planter it's 13 land impact but kind of worth it looks nice i think she made it bigger because mine is smaller and it's only seven land impact japanese heineken flavor hentai sakura <laughs> torn doing little cameo at every stream i know right i got i scared i thought it's somebody who lives in this house right first and i was like who's here and then i saw the big body and i was like ah torn okay and the sakura tree they put here that goes a little in inside the kitchen because why not you know really nicely done okay let's go to the next home and see if torn can find us there shouldn't be shouldn't be hard because casa by the sea plant pot okay there you go. I will just... Maybe if you like this pot, I, it, I think it looks interesting. Lol Thorn. <laughs> From memory, the fourth wall planter is part of the group gift wall. Okay. There we go. Okay, let's try to get to the next one. See... If, oh, what about this here? Oh, that looks cute. <gasps> okay, I didn't even see this corner here. Let's see it. Oh, that's so cute, though. With all the... I would say Chinese takeout, but okay, it's fine. <laughs> Let's say it's Japanese. There we go. It is probably Chinese with the dragons and everything. That looks cute, though. Like a cute hangout place. Where is this from? TA Ori Ori Oriental Menu Set. Aha, tar tar te Tartaros Arts there. This one. Oh, at least he's arrested now. <laughs> How bird cage not on marketplace? Bird cage not on marketplace. 
I would so love to place all my cute stuff, but the landing pad. <laughs> Naria, do you use a 3D mouse? No. I don't. I use like a normal mouse, but you have to. Uh, you have to. I was I ever talking about that? You have the camera photo tools, and you can smooth the camera up. You can, you know, you can do all this, and then just move mouse with your actually with Alt and Control sometimes. Alt probably when you hold Alt and just zoom around like this. So no, that's not a. 3D mouse, right? It's just a normal mouse with some camera smoothing and everything like that. So just try it like that. <laughs> you do nice smoothing grab camming. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Gian has a bird cage. Uh, let's go to the next stop. Wait, let me stand up. This one is really, this one was really cute for me. Also, they just build a wall for out. Look at this. So there's the garden and then they have the back of the house. This one is like some kind of a longer one. How is this one called? If you want this house, just take the Sakura Benibara. Benibara. Okay. For 512 and you're going to have then around a little more. You know, it's 1024. The house is 5 and 512. And then you have a little gar more garden around. See, you have some space to walk around let's say it like that okay let's go to house number six we have three more i love camera smoothing saved me a ton of money from buying a 3d mouse <laughs> i know right <laughs> okay another house that has their door open it's looking a little bit different so it's in kind of e shape or some not even e what tetris shape <laughs> tetris of that you know <laughs> Uh, this one is on a land. Let's see what kind of land they have and how many prims. Land. 1024, but the house is 512. Again, a little more. Um, the smaller house, but the bigger land. Again, somebody choose, right? Because you can choose a smaller house, bigger land, or you can choose a big house, I guess, with a little less land, something like that. Okay. Let's go inside. Let's jump. There we go. So yeah, they did again. It's so nice when they do all this water, right? That you can just enter on water. Uh, I think I'm going to go without lights because I see there's shiny outside. But let's go. <gasps> what is this? Bartus. Who are you? What is that? <gasps> oh my God, it's a cat. <laughs> Bartus. Poor Bartus is inside. I wish I could drag him out, right? <laughs> it's like, what the hell? Is, what the hell is this small creature? But it's the cat. <laughs> uh, all new lands are 1020. Yeah, yeah, they are. But uh, depends on what house you place on, right? You can go with a smaller house and more land around. Or you can go with the bigger house on the land, right? So then you have more house and less land around. It's like that. 1024, I think it's with everything. I think you could get a 512, though, and then you have 512 for mainland, right? You can separate it. I think it's possible here. We'll see. Look at that. Look at this one. <laughs> I just, again, I think, like, the how they do the wallpaper, it's really nice. Again, all these pictures on the walls. Look how cute this looks. Also, the plants, this whole plant thing is from Ariskea, apparently. Never seen it. Save the kitty. I can't. How, how can I save the kitty? Do you think I can hold it or something? Probably not, right? I cannot do nothing to the kitty. We can pet it, but... She's still inside, right? <laughs> That's it. We cannot do nothing to the kitty. Unfortunately, she's going to stay there. But you can choose your house with the menu in the mailbox or something. Yeah, you can choose the house. Once you get the land, you can choose what kind of style of houses you want. If you want to see all the style of houses, I do have a video of the Sakura. It's not called Home Invasions, but it's New Linden Lab Sakura Homes, I think. You can find it on my channel. I think around Explore SL, right? Um, tabs. So I did show all the houses and how they look at one point before they open this. But now they're... Anyway, I, I chose this house because look at this. Somebody just put a water wall <laughs> here. 
in the house, which is kind of, I thought it's like really interesting. So this one is entry fountain room divider entry. Teresa Firelight is the creator. So she did that herself. Oh, interesting. Okay. Teresa, we're checking your house. Don't kill me. So yeah, I, I did like the wallpapers here. Again, um, I don't know. I would suggest you to go explore a little on, on, on the land. And you'll see like a lot of houses are empty. It's hard to find though uh, a good decorated one. Some people just, they're trying, but you know. Again, the kitchen uh it's from casa okay cucumbers or what a, oh are they together oh it's everything linked casa or is it coming with all of this that's a good question hmm. but the outside i like the outside here look at this oh look another cat those cats just love wa water, I guess. If you choose a house and don't like the location, can you change it right away? Well, you can drop it, right? W once you get the house, you can go back to the page and kind of drop the house. But then I think I think you can exchange how many houses per day? I think there's a limit, right? Yes, you abandon and try again. Exactly. You abandon that house, but then try again. But I think there is a limit how many times you can do that a day either is uh, on 24 hours or something i forgot there is some kind of a limit i think you can change it like like five times or something maybe check the rules right because they don't want somebody to change it you know millions of times a day if they don't like the location but yeah you can get it if you like don't like the, the location you can drop it five per day thank you luna there i really like the outside here it's like it looks so oh zen right sounds let's hear the sounds okay they have i think this is some water i think the water is coming from yeah from this Bloop. will it go down or not huh or is it just staying because some of them are working right then they drop down at one point ah it does work. Oh, that was so cute. So this is uh, LA Sakura Simple Sushi. Oh, from malls. Really? How did she get that then? That's a good question. Maybe she knows somebody from malls. You never know. Uh, thank you for the info. I don't know. Mirna. So yeah, you can try for different houses. But yeah, just be careful how many times you exchange it. I really like this part. Open house though. Okay, cute house. Let's go to our next one. Let's see. Like the sounds here. It's kind of peaceful to be honest. So, uh, Sakura home number seven. I think this one might be. Oh, yeah, the bigger one. We did land on. Ooh. I'm gonna show you the home from the. We, we landed in the middle of the home. So, this one is a bigger one. I think the land is still 1024, but I think this is the bigger house, right? This is the 1024 house, right? So you see, we sm saw smaller houses, but now we have bigger houses. So this is 1024 house. You'll see there, there's much more space outside. You also get some of their garden, right? But let's check it out. Look how cute this looks. Oh... They really nail their exterior decor, decor every. I know, right? Look at this. Look at this place here. Come on. How cute this is. That's like gorgeous. So yeah, we have some chair. Where are the chairs from? Casa. <laughs> Everybody using casa, casa apparently. By the sea. Okay. I love this garden here though. Look at this. Also, there's like, oh, if you can hear that, wait, I'll go closer. Ooh. This is so nicely done, though. There's water. I'm going to have to pee if I listen more to it. Whoa, the land pieces. And also there, you have like a hangout space here, like just probably just to sit sit and watch at this statue here there we go i know it just looks so cute to be honest people and their decor skills 
There we go. Oh, that's a nice idea. I know. HPMD cliff. That's so zen. Ah, uh, this one is HP. Yeah, my. Yeah, yeah. You're right. Might be. HPMD tall cliff. You're right. Yeah, HPMD is freaking expensive, but to be honest, it's worth it. I I bought trees from HPMD and they're gorgeous, right? Also some uh, bushes and stuff, but they're expensive, but uh, kind of worth it once you, once you see the quality of the cliffs and or the trees or everything. Yeah, worth the money, I guess, a little. So creative. Um, but let's go inside. So this is the outside garden. This house is shaped in a U, right? So you're going to have the house all around, but you're going to have a garden in the back and kind of the middle part like this, right? Where you can also put like a garden or something. What she did apparently. Or he or whoever decorated this. Uh, yeah, it's beautiful detail. So if you go outside, look at the uh ba bedroom yeah look at this how cute is that though also there's a small uh tub wait haven't we seen this in pink at that girl hisa yeah climbing wines so guys i guess hisa has climbing vines right if you need them <laughs> for the sakura houses that's apparently a popular decor here as i saw way too cool but yeah, this is the bedroom. The bedroom ends here, uh, but we're going to go on the other side. I love those uh, curtains. Just and you step in the living room. Look at this, how cute this looks. Also, there's a sofa from Couch New England. Chez moi. Okay. Oh, she has that one that I did. Some some girl asked me where I got this. This is from Architect and it was on Happy Weekend Sale, I think, this one. It's like such a cute decor piece. Um, so, wait. Wait. Select face. Let me see. Is, is that linked together or... Wait, edit linked. Mr. Lambert. It was from Architect. Is this too... Hmm. Architect, yeah, okay. It is Architect Store. Architect and Essences. You can just find this guy and go in her in his online shop, I guess. So this was on Happy Weekend Sale, I think. That's such a cute decor piece, though. I think it was Happy Weekend. $300, well done. Wall panel behind bed. Oh my god. <laughs> that one, yeah. Um. So yeah, this is like the living room. I think it's so cute, though. So yeah, linen homes can be done nicely if if the person who's decorating knows what they're doing, right? Look at this. Also, there's like just a place to relax. There we go. Ooh, wait, where did I see this? This is such a cute... This is high on land impact though. Yeah, I knew it. Candy Haven. Oh no, that's the owner of this. Who the hell... Is this linked to something? Ah, uh -huh, Nadol Jameson, wait, profile. Craft work, yeah, craft work has these pieces. Craft work, there we go. Has these pieces, and this one I, I already checked at craft work, but it's 13 land impact, which was, which was a, a little, I was a little taken by it, but it's like really cute. So, craft work, there we go. Uh, and the front, there we go. And you can just go out, welcome home. Oh, look at that bird. And then you go back to the garden. I think in front there's not much though, except two panels and yeah, the, the small garden. There we go. But yeah, this is a bigger home. You see, you get a lot more space than in smaller ones. So yeah, you can choose. You're going to have a smaller home or you're going to have a big home, right? That's your choice then what you want to have on your parcel. Um, okay, let's go to the next one. Uh, our last one, actually. <laughs> this is how many I found. <laughs> Especially, this one didn't have an open door, but the others that I found with open doors, right? So, invited, I guess. So, this one is also, let's see the style of this one. So, this is Sakura Rabenda 1024. So, this one is one of the bigger, big, bigger two, right? See when you check it from the top. See, because this one lo looks smaller. 
So yeah, we were talking about parcels. So it is not all parcels are 1024. If we're standing on this parcel, see, this parcel is actually 1000, uh, where is it? Down here. So if you check the area, see claimed area, you have 1024 square meters. But if you go on this side, like this parcel here, which is smaller, it's 512, this here. I hope I'm not thrown out. But if you go on the land, see, uh, so, sorry, this one is 512 square meters. So it means you can claim a smaller land and then buy 512 square, square meters of mainland. Um, there's always an option to do that, right? Let's say I'm a premium, I don't want a Linden home. I, can ju I just bought... 1024 square meters of mainland and I don't pay rent there, right? So it's always an option if you're a premium, you can choose the Linden homes or you can choose the, to buy mainland and then pay no rent on it, right? So it's kind of the same. But if you really like the Linden homes, you want to li live in the neighborhood, why not? I need a video on efficient landscaping, <laughs> right? We all do. So yeah, here, uh, cute trees. I love how they did outside here. Let's let's hear the sounds around. Oh yeah. Uh, can you make your home private so no one can see you naked when you're changing? Yeah, I I mean, I was in a home. There was a guy inside, but I didn't see him. So I'm I'm gonna say yes, right? You can Linden homes. You can make them private. You can you even use the orb. Some homes I wanted to go to, uh, I couldn't even. I mean, I could get in, but. It said I'm going to be thrown out, right? So yeah, you can make them private, of course. But some people just leave them open, maybe for, you know, visitors like me, I guess. or Because I don't think there's that many trolls lurking around here. E either that, either they're then reported and probably thrown off by Lindens, who knows, or moles or whoever is. But I like this part. Look at this. There's a house. I, I love the vine vines here up stairs wait is this from water garden god knows where this is from but it's cute okay let's go inside the home the linden homes has got a security system yeah you could take it or you can leave it open look for me and we have our last home i thought this one is really interesting because they changed all the walls everything to wood right which makes it look kind of cute to be honest <clears throat> Also, look at this decor. I think this is the same that the other one uh, house had, but well, it does make it look Japanese, right? <laughs> so yeah, I, I thought it's like really nicely done because everything is wood. Oh, look, those swords too. Hmm. I guess there's some... <gasps> oh my God, where is this from? This looks so yummy. Okay, who are you? Where are you? Dahlia. Oh God. Dahlia, a little expensive, but I'm gonna... Oh, it's a disp... Oh, it's a dispenser. Oh, thank you for the margarita. Just add it to me, thanks. There we go. Probably overriding my... <laughs> oh my god, it's such a cute margarita. I... Apparently, it's uh, the poses are overriding... Override by, by my AO, but hey, the margarita looks cute. Wait, can I fix this maybe if I attach a new one? Yes. No. Not gonna happen. <laughs> Damn. Such a cute margarita though. She doesn't want to drink it. No. Oh my god, Daisy in your drink. Okay, let's see what they have in this house. I really like... Look at this. Cute. This is something... Can Fancy decor, the uh, fourth wall. There you go. Fjord wall fountain by fourth wall. That looks nice. Kind of, you can see creators by their style a little slowly. Okay, the bed. Not that big. Oh, look. the. This looks like it's from the same people. Look, they have the mouse, uh, the cats. They have the same decor of this. Huh. Maybe somebody just checked somebody's house and I was like, oh, I like all of this, right? Um, and here is, oh yeah, bathroom. Look at this bathroom, though. You have just, just the shower, washing machines, and then, where's the toilet? <laughs> and look at this cute, this is nice. Where's this from? 
select is this come Lux cascade her sink Lux Lux enduring who that never heard of the Ooh, I will save this store well I have to go check what they have to be honest Lux okay okay that's that's something to go check apparently they have Lux items I guess <laughs> Makes me wonder what they're like in real life. Liz. Is that Torn dancing in the background? He made me jump even. Where? <laughs> I didn't even see him, to be honest. Ah, yeah. Oh, my God. He's just floating there. <laughs> no home for Timmy. Question. Is that a question? or? So, yeah. Uh, what I like about this house, again, guys, the garden. Look what they did with the garden. Okay. There's thorn floating in, in the middle of the garden, but you know, it's fine. Look at him. The garden again. I don't know what they're doing with their gardens, but they all are doing such a good freaking job with it. There we go. I don't know. I just, just like it. So there we go. Let's just leave thorn there. <laughs> Is there. Oh, can we sit on this carpet? There. Oh, it's yoga. Oh, God, wait. Oh, that's so cute. Yeah, with my w glass, right? He's end out. Well, he's here still. Look at us. Damn. Oh, there was something. Oh, no. He just went into something. Oh, God, should I? Oh, wow. There we go. There we go. Thank you, Torn, for all the freaking flowers. <laughs> I'm kind of late, but hello, everybody. Hey, Yuko, you're actually at the end of the video, <laughs> to be honest. Anyway, yeah, guys, I wanted to show you the Sakura region. I think it's like, I mean, if you're into Japanese culture or if you just like the garden stuff of Japanese or whatever, right? If you like the houses, I kind of don't mind the houses because they're so open, right? And people... Oh, I didn't even see this back thing. Look at this. Oh, that's cute. Ooh. When you when you check around. So, Chemois, Sicily chair. Sicily and everything. Okay, Chemois, Sicily day bed. Okay. And we know this is start, right? From the, from the previous house. That's a cute garden. And this house is like 500 and... Rabenda, 1024. Aha, uh -huh, it is. Okay. They still have a lot of garden, to be honest. Okay. But yeah, you can take a 1,024 square meters parcel and put a 512 house on it, right? Not 1,000. So you're going to have a little more space. You'll see it once you get it. I think I have a video about how how you can have these houses. <laughs> what the hell am I doing? <laughs> so yeah, guys, this is the whole region. Uh, I think it looks cute. Ah, I said we we're going to go on top of the mountain, didn't we? <laughs> Almost forgot about that one. So as I said, there's Mount Soji in the middle. I wanted to go on top of it, so let's go. <laughs> nice home invasion today. Very zen. Thanks, Naria. No problem. So Mount Soji has on top just this. I don't know. Probably you can skate up there. But yeah, this is the main mountain here. It spans around on four regions, actually. Well, four seams, not regions. Four seams. Look how huge it is. I don't even know how to, maybe if I up my, yeah, look at this. Let's up the drawing distance. There we go. So nobody's living around here. You can see all the houses in the back. If everything zooms out. There we go. But yeah, this mountain is just here in the middle. Can't Mount Soji, God knows for what. And you can just stand in the middle and maybe <laughs> for the winter, you know. <laughs> come and uh, skate here I guess I don't know I don't know what else you could do here right <laughs> we can hear some wind though up here oh yeah Mount Fluji yeah it's called Soji actually because it's on if you check around you see you're gonna see Soji san <laughs> so it's Soji san northwest Soji san northeast Soji san southwest and Soji san southeast so they are four seams of this mountain right and nobody's living on those four seams it's just reserved for the mountain and right beside this 
this you have the community center here this black building here and everything else is livable so yeah i wanted to check how this actually looks um the new region on the balisera right isn't it an ancient volcano in real life mount fuji maybe oh wow what's inside <laughs> sometimes you just find some shit inside the mountain that you don't know well to be honest at one point when we were exploring mainland we found bones inside the lake so i guess most can hide some shit around i don't know i lost that but that was just a prim right so sometimes just check in the lakes check around because maybe they leave some of the weird stuff around <laughs> we can build a cave so i can live there there you go okay guys anyway so that was the sakura land thanks for joining me well region thanks for joining me you know if you want to grab those houses and if you're a premium go for it i think they're like it's a cute region right especially if you're into japanese fields and you want to decorate it like that well you can decorate it however you want but definitely it's nice to see the decoration that belongs to that area right um okay guys love you all of course don't forget to like subscribe or do whatever you want to do and might be a good location for japanese themed snow party or that we'll see what they do if they do anything um you know, you can always post on my Discord if there, there will be any event up here. We know Lindens always have, so, well, Lindens malls or Lindens or whoever always have something to put somewhere. It's the same on that, uh, where's that freaky island that I was last time on? There's like some island that you can rent on, on here. Aha, uh -huh, this island. So here you have the Belisera uh, fairgrounds, fairgrounds, right? This is the island on Belisera that anybody, well, rent. You don't pay anything. You have to present what you want to do there. And then you send in a request and you can actually rent it for an event or something that you have in mind. And then they approve you or not, right? So they do have some kind of hidden gems like this around. So, you know, always check what they have. Also, I don't know what those two islands are. It's nice to explore also Belisera, which are uh, which is the new continent on Second Life, right? I will go... One day I will go into continents because there are some other old ones and everything, you know, there's constant winter somewhere here. Uh, I always forget how those continents are called. You have the railway system here going all around. There's actually people role playing of delivering stuff, right? You have airports. There's so much to do on mainland. People ca ha have come out with different ideas right this whole this whole land here is kind of japanese uh, uh korean you know it's so much going on here we once drove from the lower part to upper there's so many cities like just looking korean as hell right or chinese as hell so yeah this is like an interesting place to explore but we're gonna go into that some other time because today we had the sakura land right you have a discord channel yeah, I do have a Discord. It's usually linked under my video. Um, there, uh, you can you can enter it from the under the video. You have the link, right? Just join it. You'll be welcomed here. You come in, and we have so much. Like we have so many rooms about Second Life. You have we have everything else, right? I just opened the shows, right? So if you're watching something fun. It's other games too, right? Snapshots of the games that we're playing. It's like so much to do here. So yeah, join Discord. You won't be sorry. Uh, also, I post when I go live. So, you know, I'm going live in five minutes with this one, right? So you kind of know upfront a little when I'm going to go live. So many for sale tags. Okay, guys. Anyway, uh, yeah, mainland is a lot on sale, but I think it's mostly because some people are over pricing selling it don't don't get me into some uh some numbers of how much they sell mainland right because i don't know are people crazy or you see when you when you just go on something like that sixteen thousand no hundred and sixty thousand lindens he wants for seven thousand three hundred sixty square meters you know, sometimes it's just ridiculous, r ridiculously priced. I don't know. Do, do these people then abandon 2,048 square meters for 29,350 lindens? I mean, come on, guys. <laughs> what you doing? <laughs> 
Um, okay, yeah, I do have a Discord, so join, why not? It's a little more personal than here. Greedy bastards, I know. We can go into this on some other stream. Anyway, guys, thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like, subscribe. See you next time. Love you all. Take care and bye. Sounds I'm breathing in Hold tight